When I was a child, uh, I really did not want to be Asian, and I pretty much rejected my heritage. Uh, but when I grew older, when I was in college, I started really realizing that there was a lot that I had missed out on. And uh, so I started kind of searching for my own roots. And when I looked back to find the roots uh, that I could that connected me to my own heritage. I found it in two things. I found it in stories, the stories my parents would tell me, this, the Chinese folk tales that I read when I was younger, and I found it in food. And uh, the food that we ate at the table, the food that we ate that was different from everybody else in the neighborhood. Um, and those two things are what connected me to my heritage. And that's why they're so predominant in my work. Uh, a lot of the work that I do is really me trying to trying to find my own heritage to kind of claim my own Asian identity as and so that's why a lot of my books are about those things I kind of lean into it I feel like it really gives a beautiful connection to our past home culture for more author interviews please visit readingrockets.org